We're a team around here. 923, 924. Zach Eflin and the Rays at minus 121. Alec Marsh and the Royals at plus 111. Total of eight and a half with some juice to the over at minus 120. And look, this is for me again, guy. I took the Royals double results at plus 240. I know Alec Marsh had a rough first start, but he's pitched pretty well in his last two starts against good offensive. Zach Eflin has been pitching better against poor offenses. The Rays, you cannot trust on the road. I know the Royals have some issues in their bullpen, but that offense to me is exponentially better than Tampa Bay. I think this should be flipped. I'm not sure why Tampa Bay is favored here. I'm getting value on a dog again. Give me the Royals double result at plus 240. Uh, Corby, what do you think on this one? Royals raise. Listen, if, if you're just tuning into the show for the hot dog contest, I appreciate it. Uh, let me make this really easy for you. If you see the Royals on the docket and you see a total over eight, you can assume that I like Bobby Witt to hit a home run, and nothing changes here today. Bobby Witt, home run. I didn't bet it for the show, but I will be betting it because it is 4th of July, and I want some tanks. Bobby Witt, five at-bats, two hits, a triple, a 380 expected batting average, a 934 expected slug. Zach Eflin, 370 average versus this lineup. I think Bobby Witt crushes. And listen, Kenny brought it up, and I made a tweet about it. If Kansas City's cheating, bet him at home. Bobby Witt at home. Uh, this, their numbers are drastically different at home. I will take Bobby Witt home runs. I think you can get three to one, three and a half to one. Uh, I will be taking that today. That's what why America's the best country. That's why America's right. the best country. You can cheat and get away with it because the Royals are absolutely cheating. And again, I'm with you, Kyle. The fact that they're plus money at home is is utterly shocking to me. The league isn't paying close enough attention. The Royals are not losing this game. Royals, cheaters. Yeah, I just think it's priced wrong, V-Dub. What does the base winner model say on this one? I think I fixed my sound. Sometimes the microphone cord, when I get excited, gets a little goofy. So hopefully that sounds better for everybody. Uh, what does the base winner model say here, Royals Rays? You know, I think it's an interesting uh, what, what the model is saying because I, like, I don't like the Royals. But in this case, it's showing a little bit of value uh, with the Royals. I've got the Rays priced at minus 112. You know, I, I just don't see this offense outside of possibly Bobby Witten. Props to Corby. I just scolded him. But props to Corby for hitting. I think he's gone back to back on the home run day on Tuesday. So good job, Corby, on that. But uh, I, I don't see, like, you know, just long term with this Kansas City Royals offense. I've got them rated 23rd in baseball. And that's a, like a long term rating. Last 500 plate appearances, base runs created. And, uh, I, I just don't see it, but but in this particular spot, I think that you know your bet's not that bad actually. The one the one thing that's concerning is Alec Marsh. He's his home runs per plate appearance is highest on the board at five percent. That's a three hundred sixty five day number. So I don't know. I mean, I I don't I just don't get the whole Royals love and and everybody loves the Royals here in the chat box. I, I was on a show yesterday with the the guy like move the line you like the royal so much so i I just don't see it but but for this game i th i don't think it's too bad of a play kyle that's about as much as i can endorse beat up don't you worry i'm saving a seat on this wagon for you when you finally come around and you realize that you like the royals and that they're good and that they're going to the postseason i'm gonna you're gonna have a seat in the words of bon jovi a seat right next to me and we're gonna look out that train window and watch the royals succeed in the chat it says corby messed up shouldn't have skipped breakfast have to stretch the essential areas before playing kyle should even be a bigger favorite now uh, Joe Cool says, just to put just put another case of beer on Corby to beat base winner. No offense to any of the crew. Think you're all great. Just think Corby gets it done. So uh, here we go. On Joe Cool, you're my man. You get it. There we go. go. Joe Cool kissing some ass this morning. Uh, DT plus the point says Kyle would win hot dog contest. Other three smart enough not to put their body through their, that nonsense. So, yeah, maybe just my stupidity and my just sick ego and all my horrible habits finally pay off for once. That would be great. For purposes of the show, I'm taking the Royals double result here. I, it's another game. I just think it's price draw. I'm back at a couple dogs today in the Reds and the Royals, and I'm going to take that at plus 240. Last.